And now continuing coverage this morning on the Illinois assault weapons ban. Residents have to register their weapons by the start of next year, but some officials say the state has not done enough to let them know it is required. Our Sinclair sister stations, Carson Gordy, has more on how Illinois is moving forward. Illinois gun owners who don't register their assault weapons by January 1st can face criminal penalties and potentially jail time. So far, less than 3,000 people have done so out of 2.4 million FOI card owners. Some in law enforcement believe that the state hasn't told the people about this new law well enough. To this, to this date, there's been no notification being sent out by the state to inform citizens that own those that they're required to, you know, register them. If you need to pay taxes or have jury duty, the government would send an official notice to your mailing address. After reaching out to the Illinois State Police, they've said they've notified gun owners about this law in other ways. This includes providing information on the ISP website, sending out new information through press releases, social media, or holding public meetings. Relying on you know, the curious, informed, uh, proactive citizen, probably not the way that you maximize compliance. Are there people that are know absolutely what the law is, what's going on, and are going to choose to ignore it. Yes. I spoke to a gun shop owner and individual gun owners on Friday who declined to be on camera. Some question the law's existence, and they believe that a gun register is the first step towards the government taking them away. It's highly politic polarizing. It's very hard to get kind of people trying to find common ground. 